World Cup, cup is different. Every World Cup has its own spirit. And for, for this one, the energy, the joy, the colour, the support from Africa has been absolutely amazing. Um, it's made it a very special event indeed. Uh, every World Cup has its own business model, its own commercial model. Some focus on ticket sales critically, others on commercial sponsorship. Now this World Cup uh, is, has, uh, has the, the best combination ever of sponsorship and international broadcast sales. So it's been a real step up for World Netball and the World Cup. And the empowerment of women has been uh, a constant thread through this event. Uh, and, and that's absolutely fabulous. It's absolutely aligned with our, our, our culture um, and our uh, a, a, a world, a, a world netball. It's how we were created by women for women when no other opportunities or very limited opportunities existed. So we're, we're delighted with that and delighted that Supersport has an all women crew here. I think that's the first that I've heard of in any event. Um, and the leadership of the local organising committee in Netball South Africa has been led by, by women. Um, broadcast reach, as I say, has been absolutely significant, particularly through Africa with Supersport and all the games. Um, and, and actually, we have our own new uh, app called Netball Pass, and that's extended the reach of the matches, uh, the facts, the stats, the data, um, and so and, and the number of subscribers to that is growing, um, which is going to really increase our visibility and our reach. Stacey's mentioned the close margins and the greater uncertainty in placings at this World Cup, um, more than we've ever seen before, and that's what makes uh, a very sort of contributor to being an incredibly special event um, for spectators, for the teams, of course, and for us at World Netball. And, and the athletes uh, have loved the ability to shine in this environment. Um, and it's absolutely the right time for Africa to shine. As you know, it's the first time the World Cup has ever been held on African soil. And the first World Cup was held over 60 years ago, so it's about time too. And we are delighted to be here with our African colleagues um, and experiencing a terrific event. Um, I'm going to hand over to 